Hello, you YouTubers. This is Mrs. C. A bunch of numbers. Yeah. Anyhow, um, this video I'll be making right now is on these not Hot Wheels, but they're different kind of cars that Mrs. Z has in her little collection. So I'm just gonna show you what I got. So let's see. First off, I have a Jeff Gordon car and it's a winter circle and of course for ages above four so maybe I don't qualify hmm maybe I don't I don't think I'm four years old yet I'm just joking <laughs> but anyways there you go that's the one I'm talking about and then I have another one this one's actually smaller it's in a little small box and it's kinda cute I like it it's like a, a mini car it's a mini it's so pretty. And then I have this one. Um, you probably might not know, but I really like Tabasco sauce a lot. And I mean a lot. That I would almost eat it every single day. <laughs> Anyways, um, Mr. Z, he was at this one garage sale. And he decided to surprise me and get me a wonderful gift from the garage sale. And, and this is what he got me. It's a Tabasco car. Number 35 Tabasco on the booty and on the hood and on the side. So it's interesting. It's a, uh, what is it? Hmm. It's a Revel quality precision engineered since 1945. So that's interesting, and I've never really heard of this, but it's a pretty cool car. And then another one that I recently got are two of the M2s. This one I got a little while ago, and it's a 1957 Chevrolet Bel Air, and it's so gorgeous. I totally love it. I love the color in this thing. It's so pretty. It's like green and then the white top. Oh yeah. It's one gorgeous car right there. And then another one that I got. I saw another M2. And this is a 1970 Dodge Challenger. So I had to get this one because you probably might see that the color is pretty wicked, party hardcore, and I'm sure you likes, even though it might be a girly color, but it looks good in this car. Yes. It's a purple. Oh, check it out, man. That thing is so smexy. It's so gorgeous. I totally love it. I fell in love with it when I saw it. Then there was another one I was eyeing. It was a pink one. I forgot what kind of car it was, but I was very close to getting it. But didn't realize that these were like five bucks a piece. I'm like, holy smolies. I'm not going to be spending like 20 bucks on getting like four of those. So, yeah. Oh, then I have to show you something. Yes, I had to show you my very, very first Ever to Ove by Mrs. Z. Matchbox. My very first matchbox. I got um like a couple monkeys ago. It's a Pontiac Firebird. And I really liked it because it had like silver interior and the color is like a light blue and like a shiny interior. I like it. So I had to add it. So my very first matchbox. Yes. And then these are not Hot Wheels, as I probably already mentioned in, in the beginning of this video. But I really had a awesome, like, attachment to, like, you know, superheroes. When I was little, I used to play with action figures. I loved, like, Batman, Spider-Man, X-Men, all that jazz. I was so into it. <laughs> So, I am going to show you one of my favorite heroes, and um, this is pretty cool. It's a Marvel Universe diecast collection, and this is a Wolverine. 
car. It's pretty sweet. I like it a lot. Oh, it's beautiful, ain't it? Just look at it. It's yellow. You can see the guy on there. I mean, Wolverine. What am I talking about? <laughs> oh, it's beautiful. I totally dig it. It looks like a Dodge Challenger. And there's the booty. And then the next one is a... I don't know what this one is, but I really like the style of it. So if any of you guys know what it is, can you please tell me? Because I like it, but maybe I like just a made-up car. So it's the Punisher. I like the movie. If you guys have seen the Punisher movie, that is one of my favorite movies. I love, like, revenge, action movies, gory movies, things like that. Not really much into the comedy, but I really like those kind of movies, like superheroes and stuff. So let me know what you guys think of these, and, um, yeah, I will be seeing you, hopefully, next time. So... Peace out.